I warn you before we react to this video and I speak my piece. Yeah. <laughs> it's one of those, man. It's, it's one of those. At the end of this video, I will play a Instagram clip. It will explain everything. And I want you to be my judge, juror, and audience. If you are a man that takes someone out on a date and it doesn't go the way you expect it to, do you have the right to sue someone? Ladies, our time is just as important and just as valuable as yours. We need to have some, some ground rules or establish some 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 type of decorum when it comes to going on a date. Being on your cell phone has to be one of the most rudest gestures that you can show towards a person who went out of their way and made the effort to take you out. Now, under any other circumstances, you chalk it up and take the ill things then work out you sit and have a conversation you, you share some food things seem okay but you just come to the conclusion that y'all don't match up and you, you go on with your, your life but my man here he he was not having it he wanted his 17 dollars worth of his time back and he was not playing around with it at all. So I'm going to play this video for y'all. And when it's all said and done, I want y'all to tell me how you feel about this particular scenario and how it will play out for you. Who's is being sued for $17.31. Why? Well, this man, 37-year-old Brandon Vesmar, says she ruined their date and his movie-going experience. Vesmar spoke to us Tuesday, and now Cruz wants to share her side of the story. She says he exaggerated about how much she was texting during the movie. Cruz says she only sent three text messages to her friend and tried to be discreet by holding her phone close to her. That's when she says things escalated and Vesmar asked her to stop. I leaned back over to him and I said, well, I'm just going to go. But things didn't stop there. Cruz says Vesmar went to great lengths to find her on social media. He messaged everyone on my Facebook with the last name of Cruz. He messaged them to look for me. Then a lawsuit was filed. Let me move on with my life. I'll do whatever it takes. And Cruz did just that. I would love to give you your $17.31. The two met for the first time since the date Thursday on national television. Vesmar has agreed to drop the lawsuit and Cruz, well, she says she learned to be more careful dating. My man said, uh, I want my $17 back and I need that expeditiously. He was not joking around. He when Liam Neeson it's not that deep brother it really ain't but y'all tell me in the comment section what would you do in that situation are you going to those extremes I highly doubt it 